All right, what's up friends? It's Harrison here and welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to talk about how my dysphoria has actually increased since having top surgery. Now the dysphoria that I'm talking about is not chest dysphoria, it's actually bottom dysphoria. So I got top surgery in July. I had lived my life as a man for a long time. I never felt the need to wear a packer. It wasn't really an issue in public, like when I'd be wearing pants, I wouldn't look down and be constantly thinking about seeing a bulge there, but I would be constantly looking down and seeing a bulge on my chest and having that be in the forefront of my mind. So I think that that took away all my attention. But now that I've had top surgery and I've recovered and I've started to work out and I see my pec, my pec muscles starting to develop. I'm very happy with the way that my chest looks in public with, with shirts on and stuff like that. That now I'm not worried about people looking at my chest. Now I'm worried about people looking at my pants. So it's been a constant thought in my mind now. Every time I'm sitting down, I'm crossing my legs or I'm in tighter pants and I don't see anything there. I'm thinking that, oh no, somebody's gonna look there and see nothing and that's gonna help me. A situation that really, really heightened this for me was at the gym. So I now am at a gym in Toronto, good life, and I go into the men's change room, no problem. But every time I'm taking my pants off to change into my shorts, I have compression shorts underneath. I never take those off. I don't think I have, I don't have the confidence to do that yet. These compression shorts are so tight that you just see that there's nothing there. And I would constantly like move the, move the door to my locker so that I could face that and have no chance of anybody seeing my pants. I would face the wall and I would maneuver the door in a way so that nobody could see me. But there was also a situation where I can't always have this side blocked, but I can have this side blocked. And if somebody's on this side, they could see me. And I was just always thinking of this worst case scenario, like what if somebody calls me out on it? And it was starting to scare me. Not that I ever felt unsafe and it, nothing ever happened. Nobody's ever said anything. Nobody's ever looked at me funny, but there was always a situation where I thought could happen. So I have gotten my first packer ever. I wasn't sure if I was ever going to get one. I didn't feel that it was necessary before, but now I think it's absolutely necessary. And I got it last week and I've been wearing it for the past couple days and it has changed my, my demeanor. It's changed my fear going to the gym. I, I take my pants off and I don't care because there's something there. It feels really good. Like when I'm walking around, I, I wear tighter pants all the time, like I wear tight jeans, I don't really have any loose pants. To just walk around and feel something there, it's a game changer. I'm so glad that I did it, but I, I got a small packer. I got a youth packer, so I'm gonna show it right now. Um, <laughs> it's from um, uh, New York Toy Collective or something like that. I, I, I can't remember the name, but it's like called the Archer and it's, it's the youth size. I'm 5'3" or 5'4", and I'm like 120, 125 pounds, and I'm not a big guy. So I didn't want a huge packer, but I think that this might be a little bit too small, but it's something there. And when I look in my underwear, or when I look in the compression pants and I just turn, or compression shorts, I turn to the side, it looks, it looks legit. And that makes me feel good. I think I'm gonna use this for a little bit, see how I feel with it and then I might graduate into something bigger, but now there is no turning back for me. Wearing this packer has made me feel so much better. It's like the same thing as when I started to wear just regular sports bras. It made me feel so much better when I stopped wearing a real bra. And this has the same kind of effect for me, so I'm glad that I got it, and it's something that I want to talk about because I don't hear a lot of guys talk about it. So yeah, top surgery has made me think a lot more about downstairs. And now mind you, I'm not thinking about bob surgery. That's not something that is making me want bottom surgery. It's just making me aware that I want a bulge. So this is just my personal experience. If you don't wear anything, you don't have to. Like I know people thought it was really strange that I didn't wear a binder. I didn't want to. 
and I don't think it's strange if you don't want to wear a packer. So anyways, this is just my point of view and yeah, so I hope this video helped. Um, if it did, give it a big thumbs up. Uh, if you want to follow along with my journey even more, feel free to subscribe. I post weekly videos and if you want to follow me on my social medias, they're down below and I will. See you next time. Take care. Thank you.